بسم الله والحمد لله والصلاة والسلام على رسول الله أما بعد This is a continuation of our explanation of the introduction to Talatul Usul by Sheikh Salih Fuzan, Hafibu Allah and we further on we go with the statement Rahimahullah we continue with the statement Rahimahullah so the Sheikh says, and so those who are oppressors from the people of the book, meaning the Jews and Christians, and those who oppose and challenge the right understanding, they are not of those who speak with goodness, but rather they speak with harshness, as Allah Ta'ala says in his noble book, O Prophet, strive hard against those who disbelieve in the hypocrites, and be harsh against them, their bow is hell, and worse indeed is that destination. Surah Toba, Ayat 73. And Sheikh continues on, he says, And the hypocrites are those who do not fight with the sword, but rather they want to fight with argumentative speech and harsh refutation, and they want to discourage and scare away the people from the correct way. Just as Allah Ta'ala says again in another, in another ayat, and speak to them an effective word to reach their inner selves. Surah Nisa, Ayat 63. And those who speak with, the, with these characteristics, they are the people of strangeness and collectiveness, collectiveness. And they don't want the truth, but rather they want to misguide, misguidance for the people. They want misguidance from the people. So they are those who speak from their own selves. As for the student who hides the harshness of speech with softness and mercy, because this person wants the truth, he does it because this person wants the truth and knowledge and benefit. So he, so he says, "It Lord him a a dua for you with mercy, a dua for you with mercy." And when Allah has mercy upon you, you become happy with this mercy in this world and in the hereafter. And you achieve this when you enter the mercy of Allah. And you achieve this when you enter the mercy of Allah. And we hope for Allah to account this from us. And that we hope for Allah to account this from us. And this is the ending of the Sheikh statement regarding the, uh, regarding the statement, Rahimahullah, by the author, Sheikh Muhammad ibn Tawahab, Rahimahullah. And this is what I wanted to present. The next session we will, we will begin with the statement of the author. إِنَّهُ يَجِبُ عَلَيْنَا تَعَلُّمُ أَرْبَعِ الْمَسَائِلِ And anything that I said that was incorrect from my translation is for myself and the shaitan. And anything that I said that was correct, all praise is due to Allah. سُبْحَانَكَ اللَّهُمَّ وَبِهَمْدِكَ أَشْهَرَ وَلَا إِلَىٰ أَنْتَ أَسْتَغْفَرُكُ وَأَعْتُوبُ إِلَيْهِ وَأَخِرُ دَعْوَانَا إِنَّ الْحَمْدَ لِلَّهِ رَبِّ الْعَالَمِ